the Seattle Sounders, the first MLS team to ever make the title game of the Champions Division at the Generation Adidas Cup. And they face off with as strong and as big a team as you can find in Valencia, one of the powerhouses of La Liga. As you mentioned, Dave, the first MLS side. Leva breaking into the box, an early chance coming here. And it's blocked by who else? Ivan Munoz, the captain of this Valencia side. The first MLS side to play in the final of this is against Valencia, who expects to be here. And it was always going to be this guy. Daniel Leva making a statement early. They've had to grind out results, and that takes its toll. Ball clipped in here. Ferran casts it down, turns to shoot on it, and hits the post, and Jesus can't score. Sounders let off the hook. Ferran brings it down on his chest in the box. The cross from the right side from Jose. Did Conrad Lee get just a touch? Doesn't matter in the end. Okay, I've done my job running behind. I need to come into that gap and get the ball into my chest and then bring my teammates into it with a layoff. Hill here, trying to get it back. Ocampo Chavez! Another carbon copy, the exact same play as the opening game. Ocampo Chavez hit the post last time, and this, he can't put on frame. The man who has barely missed all week Puts wide, perhaps his easiest chance he's had. But you can see the work he puts in. David, you asked earlier, does he work hard enough for his teammates? And the answer is absolutely yes. Look at this. It appears to be a dead ball. It appears that he has no chance, but he has the pace. He has the energy to chase it down. Now Jesus is flying forward. The substitute. Julio gets it into the feet of Ferran, looking to turn and get a shot away. It's deflected off the post. Seattle, by the skin of their teeth, still alive in this one. How many lifelines do each of these teams have defensively? First off the post for the left post for Valencia, then Ocampo Chavez misses. Now off of the right post, and you can see the power of Valencia's number nine, Ferran holding off Kitahara, and then the skill to pull it back. Jesus in the right place at the right time there. And everyone on Seattle with their hearts in their mouths. Six days, and he's still going end line to end line. He charges forward now to link up with Serrano. It goes wide for Kitahara, cut back on the floor. It's knocked down on the far post now, Ocampo Chavez. A second cross floated in, Serrano! Seattle Sounders with the goal! They do it again, an extra time goal, and that could be it. And it's little Ray Serrano getting up on the back post for the finish. It comes from the right side. So what do you do? You head it back across the goal. The poor clearance from Valencia. Once again, the counter pressing from Villanueva for this time. And it's the usual goal scorer, Ocampo Chavez picking up his head. And what a cross with his right foot. Serrano one step back, but the power to arch his back, to arch his neck, and ping it back across the goal, out of the reach of the goalkeeper. An inch perfect goal is what this game was going to demand, and Seattle delivered it. They won the Premier Division last year. They wanted to show that they were one of the best teams, not just in the country, but in the world. And right now, they've knocked off Flamengo. They've locked, knocked off River Plate. They've knocked off West Ham. And they've knocked off Valencia. Seattle Sounders are the winners of the 2019 Champions Division of the Generation Adidas Cup. You see what it means to these two teams, Bobby.
Tears of joy for Seattle. Tears of despair for Valencia. But this Seattle Sounders team, as a club from the top down in this group, have earned everything they've gotten. We're going to be back in just a moment for the goods. We're going to see this cup get lifted. The Seattle Sounders make history, and they are the 2019 Champions Division title winners. On uh, behalf of uh, MLS and Adidas, it gives me great pleasure to present to you this 2019 GA Cup to the Seattle Sounders. Congratulations. When we talk about reaching the heights of American and Canadian and Major League Soccer, it starts here. The end product is the World Cup. The end product is MLS Cups, but it begins here. It begins with these 15-year-olds, these 16 and 17-year-olds training four times a week, showing up and traveling the country to play games, to go through tournaments like this, the adversity they faced. It's this moment, if you're a Sounders fan, and print this in your brain, because all of the joy that is to come because every single one of these players has the ability to play for your first team. Remember this when your first team lifts MLS Cups in the future. This club has built itself out at the first team level with signings like Nico Lodero and Raul Ruiz Diaz, but they're building the next generation of stars at home in this academy. 